Hey there everyone, let's talk about something that many of us might experience at some point, a high respiration rate. Now don't stress out just yet, because today, I'm going to walk you through what it means and what you can do about it. First off, what exactly is a high respiration rate? Simply put, it's when you find yourself breathing faster than usual. This can happen for a variety of reasons, from physical exertion to anxiety, or even underlying health conditions. For adults, a normal respiration rate is usually between 12 to 20 breaths per minute. If you're consistently above that range, it's worth paying attention to. So, what should you do if you notice your breathing rate is higher than normal? The first thing you want to do is try to calm yourself. Stress and anxiety can significantly impact your breathing rate. Find a quiet space, sit down, and focus on taking slow, deep breaths. Inhale deeply through your nose, hold it for a few seconds, and then exhale slowly through your mouth. This can help bring your respiration rate back to normal. Next, consider your activity level. If you've been physically active, give yourself some time to rest and recover. Your breathing rate should gradually return to normal as your body calms down. On the flip side, if you've been sedentary, it might be helpful to stand up, stretch, and take a short walk. Sometimes just changing your position can make a big difference. Hydration also plays a crucial role. Dehydration can lead to a faster respiration rate, so make sure you're drinking enough water throughout the day. Aim for at least 8 cups or about 2 liters daily. And remember caffeinated and alcoholic beverages can dehydrate you, so keep those to a minimum. Now let's talk about when you should seek medical attention. If your high respiration rate is accompanied by other symptoms like chest pain, dizziness, or shortness of breath, it's important to consult a healthcare professional right away. These could be signs of a more serious condition that needs immediate attention. Additionally, if you have a chronic condition like asthma or COPD, make sure you're following your treatment plan and using your medications as prescribed. Regular checkups with your doctor can help you manage your condition and keep your breathing rate in check. Lastly, consider incorporating relaxation techniques into your daily routine. Practices like yoga, meditation, and mindfulness can help reduce stress and improve your overall respiratory health. Even just a few minutes a day can make a big difference. All right, folks, that's a wrap on how to handle a high respiration rate effectively. Remember, it's all about staying calm, monitoring your activity, staying hydrated, and knowing when to seek medical help. Thanks for tuning in, and don't forget to breathe easy. Catch you in the next video. Take care.